Hi there, welcome to Amy's Workouts. We're doing an express 10 minute total body conditioning workout today. Starting with our legs wide and shoulder roll back. Then we're going into squats. Inhale on the way down, exhale as you come up. Good, push the knees back, last one here, nice deep breath. Good, toes forward, and we're reaching the arms forward and back. Tummy in, really reach through the arms, nice long back. Good, so this is our final one. Then we're gonna shuffle the feet in, just under the hips, hands onto our hips, and pelvic tucks. So imagine you're trying to put your hip bones onto your ribs. Squeeze the bottom, keep the tummy in tight. These are almost like little ab crunches. Good, knee raises. Opposite hand, opposite knee, just tap it out. Nice and high with the knee. See if you can get the knee up to hip height or even higher. So keep telling yourself the higher I get this knee, the more I'm gonna work those lower abdominals, that muffin top. Good, now keep with the knees, and we're gonna raise the arms overhead. Now pull the arms down, elbows to waist. Good. And we're going across the body, opposite elbow to opposite knee. Good, now we're taking the hand down to the inner heel, reach. Now try not to bend, bring that leg up to tap. Great, well done, warm up's finished. We're gonna start the main workout. Now we start pretty quick. You wanna have nice wide legs. We're going for wide leg squats first of all. Good, arms come up to shoulder height. As you lower, push those knees back, and as you raise, push through the heels and really squeeze the bottom. Don't forget to breathe. Chin up, chest up, tummy in. That's fantastic, keep going, there's a few of these. Good, now get ready because we're gonna hold down and pulse on this next one. Take it down and pulse, pulse, pulse. Good. Now we're holding still, take the arms back. Good, so don't let the arms bend, keep them at shoulder height. Four, three, two, and take them forward. Good, still low in the legs. Now we're not stopping, go back to those pulses. Now put your palms up, I know you can't see my hands, and we're gonna flex. So I like to call these He-Man arms. Really squeeze the biceps as you come in. That's great. And squeeze. Now we're gonna hold the arms in and reach up and pulse. So we're pulsing in the legs, pulsing in the arms. Just a little tiny movement. Now bring the elbows together forward. Right, we're gonna go back to full squats now. And as we come up, we're gonna open the arms wide. Good. So working through the chest as well as the legs. Legs should be feeling the burn by now. Good, really squeeze the elbows in. Good, now we're gonna hold and pulse on this next one. Elbows are nice and tight. Last one here and relax, great 
job. So the first half is over. Go grab some water. We've got a little break before we move on to some more squats. So I apologize in advance. This section also includes a bored 10 year old boy. Um, try to ignore him. Let's squat to the left. <laughs> Good, so step it out, hips back, and just sit down into the heels and hips. Chest is high. And now we're gonna squat and leg lift. So keep the legs straight and lift with the heel. Try and flex the foot. We wanna work the outer thigh. Good, keep the squat nice and deep. Keep your tummy in, keep your chest up. That's fantastic, weight in the heels, keep going. We're gonna hold and pulse. And we're going to the right side now, lift and squat, lift. This is where I'm actively ignoring him. Keep going. Having my head chopped off now. Things we have to do to work out. Uh, sit, keep squatting, keep lifting. Hold and pulse. Good, make sure there's no weight going through your toes. Everything's back. Now we're gonna do touchdown. So step it back and with the same hand, tap to the floor. Take it back. Good. So you can go slow with these, you can go fast. You don't have to take it all the way to the floor. If it's easier, just step the leg back. Make this movement your own. I'm having to move around a lot just to avoid my son. <laughs> Good, keep going. Now we're gonna hold the left leg back and then straighten and bend the left knee, the back leg knee. Good. Now full lunges, chest comes up, legs to 90 degrees. Good, we're using that front heel for balance, for pushing through the weight, don't come forward. Last one, and relax. Gonna have a little break before we go back to touchdowns again, and then we're gonna do everything again on the right side. So get ready, step it back, tap it to the floor. Good, now we're gonna hold the other leg back, right leg back, and we're gonna Bend and straighten the back knee. And we're going to full lunges. Now any aggravation in the knees from lunges, go back to your normal squats. Great, now we're gonna hold and pulse. And I'm terribly sorry, you're about to get shot with a Nerf gun. <laughs> <laughs> right, moving on, legs come together, narrow squat, take the left leg out and point the toes. Get your balance and we are lifting. So this is a fantastic move for the lower half. Good, and hold and pulse. Keep that tummy in, well done. Right side, so legs straight, toes are pointed. Make sure all the weight is going through the heel of that standing leg. You don't wanna be coming forward onto your toes. 
Good, keep going. We've got some pulses next. Take it up and pulse. Good, my balance is a lot worse on this side. And <laughs> relax, well done. Fantastic job.